Hey guys, welcome to our Nintendo Hall. Our so I was an idiot and didn't pre-order this. So I literally spent all day trying to hunt this thing down. We went we went to Timbuktu. If that's a saying. And to we're gonna find out if traveling to Timbuktu was worth it. Yes, we will. So we're just gonna give you a little overview of what we got. Um we got the Zelda Amiibo because it does like special stuff within the game. I personally wasn't I was telling myself like I'm not gonna buy Amiibo. I'm not gonna buy Amiibo. Well, I bought an Amiibo. Why'd you buy that Amiibo? I mean not I'm not sexist or anything. Too that sexist. But um because she gives you the highly highly in shield. Oh okay, never mind, that's worth it. Yes. So I have Wolf Link. Wolf Link, you, when you scan it. Wolf, there's an old wolf. Yep, Link Wolf comes in. Wolf of the Link comes in and it'll help you scavenge for stuff. That's nice. Which would be really cool. I'm excited for that one specifically. Personally, I don't like how Nintendo has like how much memory their systems can store. Like I'm, I'm already don't like how like Xbox and PlayStation do theirs because you run out of memory so fast. I got this 64 gigabyte um, sand disk. Pixar. Pixar? Make sure. Uh, just so I have more memory on the Switch for more games and more fun. And more friendly, friendly, portable gaming. Play basketball with your friends outside. You got Mario Kart? Uh, <laughs> this is only, you can only buy it in 32 gigabytes, which is a bit of a shame because then you need more storage. Because if you have a larger game like Zelda, I guess I don't know how many gigabytes this is. A lot. Then you run out of storage quick, and you're like, great. But now I only got one game on my Switch. I'm gonna, and a, but I want to play other fun games like Super Bomberman R, which is a super fun game. I'm excited to play this. We're probably gonna play it on the channel, mainly because Sherman and I grew up playing uh, Bomberman and, on the N64 and Legend of Zelda. Yeah, well, both obviously. Bomberman. Bomberman was super fun. So we got these two. Um, have you, you've already seen the cartridges? I'll show you the oh, yeah. inside. It seems kind of crazy that they give you this huge case, and then this, like, <laughs> in this tiny little cartridge. I'm more worried about I'm, losing them. Yeah, I guess. But if you put them away, in the right cartridges, box, things, then we won't lose them. Oh. Uh, anyway, let's move on to Bomberman. Super Bomberman! R. This one's up to four, eight players on the TV, but it was portable. It's up to four. Um, controls are actually pretty expensive. They're like eighty bucks. Yeah. What, 80? 80. I read like just the little switchy things are like this. The the like this here. This here. Buying two of these is eighty bucks. That is. Well, there's a main like a my. There's a lot of major shit. component. A, yeah, there's a lot of like technology in them. Is that crazy? Remember when we watched the uh, the live, yeah, reveal? Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so here's <laughs> game's not in there. No, I'm <laughs> kidding. Uh, here's what the Bomberman R one looks like. That's really cool. They're really small. Like some of these are are detailed, like the Zelda one, but it's so small it's like it's hard to see. Yeah. Um. Anyway. Let's get past all this. Let's, let's start let's opening. Eat. Let's start eating the meat and potatoes of this. Let's opening. get to the meat and potatoes. We got done with the, the peas. Movie. It's time we get to the meat, which is the Nintendo Switch. Switch. Now, if I can only find the lever. Now. 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 You only find the trap door. It's Where's the trap door? Dude, follow this. Oh! I don't know if we should cover this, but right here, uh, it shows you what comes in the box. I always like that. <laughs> For all those people out there that don't know what's in the box, this will help you because earlier today I did not know what was in this box. Wow! Look it! On the front. Oh my gosh. On the front, it, it, it's giving you directions. You got step one, plug it in. Step two, set it up. That's it. Here, it here we go. We got the new iPad Mini unboxing right here. This is an iPad. This is a <laughs> iPad Mini. This is Nintendo and. Apple team up. Throwing this it. is actually like the size of a like a phone. Like really? Yeah. Like hold. You can like hello. Hello. Oh yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. Better be careful. You just break it. What the heck, dude? 
Oh, this is, this is like, I mean, we're not big people. I'm uh, 200 pounds. I mean, that's a lie. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, that's a really cool screen. <laughs> but, hey, I honestly didn't know they were this small. Really? Like, I, I heard some people complain because, like, they have big hands. hands. Yeah, they're like, I got, I got giant hands and, oh. Wow. This is really cool. Now hold it like you're going to play a game. Yeah, no, I hate this already. All right. Well, I mean, welcome to We Return Things, uh, the channel. <laughs> um, <laughs> just kidding. We we'll learn to live with it. But let's get to the... Dude, dude I've just been all day looking for this. Bread and potatoes of it. Bread and potatoes. All right. So, what are you doing? I'm switching. Wait, wait, wait. I'm just going to switch. Wait, wait, wait. I want to see what else is in here. All right, let's, let's, control. let's take a look. I'm putting this over here. All right, what we got here is Wait, some wires, probably you know charger. which one's right and which one's left. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> There's little things right there. Here is, I think, are the the, the, the little things that you connect to your wrist to make oh. sure it doesn't... And also the oh, shoulder this, button, so that, oh, that the, Yeah, it makes the thing bigger, too, because now you can use those a lot hmm? easier. You oh, just well. slam it on... Oh. So... People say, that's really cool. I don't know how to take it off now. There's probably a button. Don't try to rip it off, please. I'm going to rip it off. Don't. Stop. I'm, rip I'm ripping it off. Don't. Yep, I don't know how to take that off. That's on there forever now. Oh, okay. So what? I got the controller there? now. This is still small. Like, honestly, that's kind of small. But it? it probably feels small because it doesn't have the... Wow, this is very mechanical. Ooh, <laughs> wow, that's awesome. So it also includes in HDMI, of course. You need a high def for Z the, and you got your uh, USB Type C uh, charger for your the console. It's crazy that this is it. This is the console. It's kind of yeah, and it's this is it. This is every. You gotta give props to Nintendo for making a small console for such like graphical power. You know, graphical power. graphical power. Is that a word? Yes. Um, I made it up. That's cool. Now let's. I don't work. like the feel of it. Do you like it? Ugh, I hate that. It's just you'll get used to it. It's like. All right, so here we got we got the the Look. full. I like my least favorite. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Oh, that is cool. Look how tiny that is, though. It's like a candy bar. It's smaller than like a net and like an Xbox controller. Now I can say right away that I thought this would be a problem, but it's not. Like on what it. is a problem? Just like the way how bulky it is, you know? Oh, the like, yeah, because it's like not ergonomic. Maybe I don't know. I feel like when I'm no, that won't get in my way. Depending on what the buttons are, I feel like the right stick will get in my way. Oh, I see what you're saying. But if I have my hand up far enough, like if I'm trying to reach for B or Y, it's gonna be a problem. But I still think it's not that bad. Oh, it's not that bad. Now let's do the switch together. Ready? Wait, no. What's this? That's like the what it, you hold it in. It's the kind of like. It's what. Wait, what, where'd you put the other wristband? There's only one. Really? Yeah. Which is kind of kind of not cool, but whatever. Mm -hmm. It's two. It goes right there. There's two. Is yeah. it in the box? It was just right here. Oh, it's right here. Oh, okay. This is really nice. So you got the HDMI, you got the USB and the AC adapter ports right here. What's nice is that uh, it's like a cable man manager the back here. Yeah, it's not it's that. It's all like coiled here and it comes out right here in this nice little little package, little package. It's got USB on the side here. It's got two. And now, Truman's being crazy. That's because I want to freaking do a little presentation for you guys. All right, let's, let's do that. this together. We don't want that in here. Yeah, let's do this together. All right, we have to flip it this way, though. Make sure you take this one out with this one. Do you think, does it make the noise? Ready? Three, two, one. Nintendo! <laughs> let's play! All right, that's, oh, cool. that, that's really cool. That's cool. Honestly, this is, wow. That's actually, I probably would play it like this. Honestly, it sums up. One word? Let me see this. Hold it. It's if I, if I could sum this up in one word, wow. 
Oh, um, that's really cool. I know. Um, hey, hey, hey! That's pretty cool. Oh, that's a kickstand. From what I've heard, is that the back can feels very flimsy, but we're not going to be using the back that much. Yeah, I saw someone use it. It looks like it's fine. Yeah. Wait, how easy it is to take it off? I guess I'm not really used to it right now. Yeah, I feel like that this product is a very step in the correct direction Nintendo is taking. Is really I still cool. don't like the the fact that it has a screen. I don't know. I just didn't like the Wii U. Maybe that's why I'm, I'm a little bitter towards this part. I like, I don't know, I've always liked the, the courage of Nintendo, and I'm happy now they're branching out to second, third party yeah, cause developers. Yeah, they not any games for the Wii U. Yeah, they, they're sucked. just like crappy, like, I mean, people are saying Skyrim's coming out, and I think it is because the trailer had Skyrim in it. So Tucker, get your views. What do you? What think? are? What is my rating for the Nintendo Switch? I haven't really tested it out yet, but just like first impression. First impression, yeah, I like it. I've got to say, a solid four point five out of five. Like, there's some stuff that I'm not used to, which is why I, presentation. You know, I'm gonna give it a four because I feel like playing it and interacting with the games on here will, you know, give that extra point to. 10 out of 10. I am super excited for this. I, um, I feel like Nintendo's making good decisions. This gives my completionist rating of... Of complete it. Complete no. it. <laughs> Buy it. I don't know. I don't Thanks know. for watching, I guess. Yeah. Uh, don't forget to comment. If you thought we were babbling idiots, comment. If you think that we weren't babbling in, in, uh, idiots, like. Comment. Or comment. You... Would like to watch another one? Subscribe!